Uh, we welcome in the name of the Lord, Rosalind Alexandra Bybee and her parents, Sean and Micah Bybee. Also, Kaya Joanne Holloway and her parents, Uriah and Leah Holloway. Perfect. In this service of dedication, we are first to give thanks to God, the maker of all things, the giver of all life, for the creation and birth of these beautiful, beautiful children. Sleeping or not? <laughs> you know, maybe we should start bothering. <laughs> we will. <laughs> Secondly, we are to make a solemn promise as parents. And as a church, relying on God's help and working in partnership together, we will endeavor to bring up these children in the discipline and instruction of the Lord. Third, we are to pray for God's blessing that it may descend and rest upon these beautiful children. Remembering how Jesus took little children in his arms, blessed them laying his hands upon them. With the baby's grandparents, Gary Fulmer and Ann Bybee, John and Jerry Holloway, Tim and Jan Moore, and Cindy Moore, please come forward and stand by your respective children. <laughs> See, I said, this is, this is going to get confusing. So all the grandparents, get all of them up here. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Let us now hear the word of God. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your might. And these words which I command you this day shall be upon your heart. And you shall teach them to your children. And you shall talk about them when you sit in your house, when you walk by the way, when you lie down, and when you rise. The steadfast love of the Lord is from everlasting to everlasting. His righteousness, grandparents, to children's children. And we are to teach them to remember to do His commandments. Now I would like to invite <coughs> Rosalind's and Kaya's other relatives to come forward. And you can just sort of choose where you stand. Um, so start coming. Brother Phoenix, come on, buddy. Grandmother Ann, who's already up here, great-grandmother Barbara, aunt and uncle, Anza and Steve, cousins Brindley and Quentin, cousins Uriah and Leah and Kaya, for them. Great-grandmothers Barbara Carlson, Barbara Holloway, uh, Pat Wiedemeyer, uh, great-aunts, uh, Ann Bybee, Victoria Bergwin and John Bergwin, uncle and aunt uh, James and gentlemen Parrish, uh, Janelle Moore, Uncles Sean Moore, Ryan Moore, uh, Uncle Eli, Cousins Mackenzie, Michaela, Sean Michael Phoenix Roslyn, Steve and Anson really Quentin also for over here. And everybody else, just come on. So everybody kind of squeeze in toward the middle a little bit here. Because there we go. Show the love. It's all right. You don't have to be in a single file line. It's all right. You are very special. You have lots of people here to, to share you with God. And they were bringing children to him that he might touch them, and the disciples rebuked them. But when Jesus saw it, he was indignant and said to them, Let the children come to me, for to them belongs the kingdom of God. Ooh. That's right. Truly I say to you, whoever does not receive the kingdom of God like a child, shall never enter it. And he took him up in his arms and blessed them, laying his hands upon them. And by the way, this was great, great, great grandfather's christening gown, 135 years old. This gown. How special is that? Parents, in presenting these children to the Lord, you promise in dependence on divine grace and in partnership with the church. Teach them the truths and duties of the Christian faith by prayer, precept, and example to bring them up in the discipline and instruction of the Lord 
If so, would you say we do? Grandparents and family members standing here, do you promise to aid and support these parents in their lifelong endeavor to raise these two beautiful children in the discipline and instruction of the Lord? If so, say we do. We do. Do you, as members of this church and visitors who believe in the Lord Jesus Christ, acknowledge and accept the responsibility together with the parents and family of teaching and training Rosalind Alexandra and Kaya Joanne that being brought up in the discipline and instruction of the Lord, they may be led in due time to trust Christ as Savior, confess Him as Lord and baptism, be made a member of His church. If so, will you signify your response by standing? Parents, if you'll come out this way a little bit, just get right next to each other. I'm going to come behind you. No, I'm just in front of you. <laughs> and other relatives, if you come close and just kind of place your hands on these parents, on the people in front of you who have their hands on the parents. Let's pray. Lord God, we ask your blessing to descend right now. Um, upon Rosalind, Kaya. Your children, Lord, which you created and entrusted to these parents who love you so much and who are this day dedicating them to you, Lord, to your service, to your kingdom, to your protection. They're asking for your angels to be around them as they walk through this life, as they will discover difficulties and great joys, as they too will one day, Lord, grow up to put their faith and trust in you, we dedicate them to you. And in this very moment, we dedicate their parents to you. That even though they'll make mistakes, they'll get the principles right. And they'll teach these two beautiful children to come to know you. Lord, bless their extended families and this church family as we seek to teach these children everything about your great love. Holy Spirit, fill them right now with yourself. God bless them as they're dedicated to you. In Jesus' matchless name, we pray. Amen. Amen. God bless you all.